What is up, YouTube? Sir Wilson is back for episode number 35 of the Pokemon Shield Wedlock. We are in Winden. We just headed up to Rose Tower, went through, defeated all of the Macro Cosmos, part of uh, Mr. Rose's uh, affiliations and subsidiaries, going through the tower to get to Leon, to get Leon to come battle us for the Champion Cup. Well, we got to Leon. They had some discussion about the, Gal the future of Galar and, well, um, after that, I came back to this Pokemon Center. Um, before going into these battles, I did some grinding on the side um, to get Dynamax candies for these two. So I, I, I did as many as I could. Um, there was a five-star Hippowdon, which I know I cannot beat um, with any of these Pokemon. And that's the last Dynamax battle that is in the wild area. I could go to the Isle of Armor, but whatever, we're here. Um, I really don't want to go... I, I got enough. Uh, 11 candies between the two of them is pretty good for me. So, um, let's flex this right here. Look at all these, look at all these ground types. Ground types and water types. And look, they're all on the ground. <laughs> it's a great looking team. Super powerful, super tanky. Good combination of speed now. Roserade comes in and adds a whole lot of depth in damage and uh, speed uh, while also providing a little bit of uh, stall tactic with leech seed protect so um, we've got some good options there I like her I like her paired with Easton I think that was a great a great pair so now that they've got some Dymax candies everyone except Duskla uh, and these four have, are full of Dymax candies but Duskla only has two because Duskla shouldn't be Dymax much all right so let's head on in so Wilson! This is it. Here at Wyndham Stadium, the greatest stadium in all of Galar. You're gonna show everyone the greatest battle ever, mate, and set the world on fire. So, go get yourself checked in. Hop, ah, you're not upset at all that I stole your dream? I mean, you were the one saying you were gonna battle Leon, and look who, look, 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 look who it is doing it. Challenger, Sir Wilson, we've been waiting for you. Since you won your way to the semifinals, you must face off against Jimmy's in the final, and they won't be holding down. Whoever makes it through this final bracket will win the right to challenge the champion. So, are you ready to go to the locker room now? Yes, straight away, then I'll show you your way. Oh, one thing I was going to look at is levels. Um... First we battle Beef, levels, I'm just checking levels. Okay, everyone goes up to 55, but it's when we come back and uh, Leon is at 65. Uh, I don't know who I battle first. Oh, Beef, right. Well, since she's rocking Psychic and Fairy types, um, man, it's best to go with Mud and Duskla. So I'm going to lead with mud. Alright. Mud and Duskla. And then it's Nessa. And then Alistair and Rayhawk in this gen. So the only difference is that it's not B. Okay. From the from sword. Oops, didn't mean to do that. We're ready to go. Everyone is pretty over level for these. Because the highest we'll fight is Rayhon, who's at 55, and thus was at 58. It probably goes without say. Blah blah blah. The chairman's time was some business, so I hope no one minds stepping in. In order to lead you all to greater heights as Pokemon trainers of the Galar region, the time has come for you to battle and out until only the greatest challenger remains. So on behalf of the chairman, allow me to say, let the final matches begin. Woo! Gosh, the eyelash stuck. I know, I keep touching the mic. Wait, you. Who's 
is that? Says the whole audience at once. A moment, if I may. Does anyone here even remember me? I am B, the challenger who is forced to withdraw from the gym challenge. B, he's the challenger who the challenge and rose himself. I have a score to settle with challenger Sir Wilson here. I'm aware that this is against the rules, but I must ask nonetheless. Let me battle him. I'll stake my career as a challenger on this battle. If I lose, I'll retire from being a trainer. What an unexpected turn of events. Former challenger Beat has come for one last battle. We are currently debating to all of our viewers, both here in the stadium and at home front of the telly. We ask that you please be patient. I know this is ridiculous of me, but I had to say something. Do something. But ever since you showed up, everything I've done has gone wrong. It was Oleano who asked me to gather wishing stars for the chairman, but then the chairman dis himself disowned me. And that strange old lady comes out of nowhere and drives me into boot camp on fairy type Pokemon. Do you have any idea what I've been through? Covered in pink, dealing with poisons and battles with fairy type Pokemon every day? And here I am, pulling my heart out to you, but I've never lost my cool before. We've reached a decision, ladies and gentlemen. The champion himself, as expected, beats sudden interruption. Oh, accepted. <laughs> Is the champion showing his love by giving every trainer a chance to grow stronger, or is it a trial of Challenger Sir Wilson? My will hasn't been broken yet. Okay, B. Okay, B. <laughs> My while. Hasn't been a while since I've seen a Ma while. We saw one in the last episode. We face too much to quit now. We've got no choice but to win. Oops. <laughs> I didn't mean to die to Max. <laughs> Whoops. Well. Here's the mud. <laughs> oh, I clicked over so fast. I didn't need the max quake at all either. Like I knew high, high horsepower would still almost kill if not, but that was... Well, that happened. We're just boosting our defenses. Well, mud's gonna be so hard to kill now. Good. Good, yep, we'll do some, some of this. I'll go for one to the fight. Cause I think it'll outspeed me. Oh, well, he went for combine. That was a mistake. I was hoping he would actually attack so I could get double, double defense boost off this turn, but I'll settle for one and KO. Bye-bye, Gardevoir! Rapidash. Dazzling Gleam for a stamina boost. I'll finish Rapid Ash off with a Max Quake for an extra special defense boost for the Hatterene. Boom! Hmm, all of these people have four. Do they? Do they have four or five of these now? Once you get to... Okay, it's just B who only has four. Everyone else has five. I was like, why... I, I should have used... Oh, we didn't kill Rapid Ash with the max plate. <gasps> oh, no. Oh, you went for full restore? You full restore? Mud used Heavy Slam! Wow. Wow, that did a lot of damage. Wow, Mud, you are heavy. 
Esmeralda to 55. Get some more life leftovers. Put you at full health. Had me. What's with that kind of person? Think you're going to win? As a matter of fact, I do. Even though you're going to G Max, you should shudder. Oh, I can't use Heavy Slam on it. Ooh, that's unfortunate. Oh well. We'll show you a truly great team. It's time for my dear Hattery Gigantic Act. Sorry, Mud will still tank so well. Mud is super tank. Yeah, speed. We do like a third. Nah, it's not a third. It did less than half. That's good. And it didn't go for G Max Light, so we're not confused, thankfully. Defense boost is just not mastering. Power puts me down below 50. So we're doing like 30%. <gasps> no! No, come on! No, mud! No! Veed, <laughs> you are so evil! Oh my gosh! So close. I wanted to move from that old clan. I plan on making it my own. You actually went for the smite this time. That does so much damage. I can't believe it. You got two crits. See what I'm talking about? This game just goes hacked crazy in these battles. That's ridiculous. God dang it. Oh my gosh. Mud. All because I Dynamaxed right away. What the heck? It looks like Challenger Bead was no match for Challenger Sir Wilson, his trusted team. Hey, baby, that was some match. Don't retire. Just restart your career. But, but this isn't what I planned. If I was able to defeat you, then everything would be fine. Even if I lost, I was going to use retiring as an excuse to get away from that old lady. You just keep messing up my plans. With everyone cheering me on like this, I have no choice but to continue my training as the fairy type gym leader. Though... I suppose with my talents, I'll be able to take over. I'll be able to overtake Miss Opal in, in no time. Oh no! Oh, you sneak in just to kill my mud. In any case, once you're ready, please go ahead on to the, the finals. Are about to get. I can't partake in the finals without mud. Ah! Oh my gosh! That's so bad, so bad, and I lost a po a Pokemon with full Dynamax. Can't Dynamax can't just get so hard to get now. Ah! Just one crit. But you get two. And thank thank goodness Duskla didn't knock herself in confusion. I could have healed, but I was like, you know what? You know what? 
I'm gonna test my luck. And thankfully it paid off, Duskla. Okay, but you are now a lone female who needs to go with a male. So these are the male options. As a ghost type, we really don't want to put you with Mercury. That's Gengar. Mm, you, to resist, Lift Bro, Lift Bro could be good. Um, Pierce is a man. We just have no speed if we do any of these. We'd just be so slow, but super tanky again. But the thing is, Mud is Mud gets tankier. There's none of these really have that option. Guts, I could do like Flame Orb. I'm a champ. That's kind of risky. I do have sturdy geek power. Gigalith. Um, Bear Arms is the perfect partner. As normal fighting, you resist weakness. But you have Klutz. Do you keep Klutz when you evolve? I think you do. Fluffy and Klutz turns into Fluffy and Klutz. It's awful. So dumb. Uh, well. Crookedy Croc. Who do I really want to use? I really want to use Lift Bro. I never ever get to use my champs. I think I used a Machamp once in a Pokemon Sword uh, Nuzlocke that I was doing on my own and it definitely died. So we're gonna do this. You are guts. I have to get you. Oh, thankfully, you'll get to level 57 thanks to uh, <laughs> thanks to Dustle being your partner. You'll go up pretty quick. Both of those on me. That's 44. Chop, bulk up. Fifty seven. Size and toss. Fifty four. Dynamic punch. Fifty six. Seven. Oh look, yeah. I'm gonna give you a couple more of these. Yeah, cause look at where Duskla is. Okay. Uh, man, that is so rough. Oh man. Okay, what do I give you? Do I go with Flame Orb? Do we give you Flame Orb and protect? Protect? I want to do close combat. Um, payback. I, li I like payback here. I could even do something that like drops B, but no, we want something to hit ghost types if we have to. Let's do low kick or low sweep. No. Isn't it? Isn't it TM? 
Do I not have it yet? Hmm, I thought low sleep was a TM. Let's see if you're... Oh, I can't reteach him. Dang it. We gotta figure it out. We gotta figure something out. I need brick break. Close combat. I really don't want to do close combat. I can do reversal. Yeah. Low kick. Brick, I think it's brick break. Well, welcome, Lift Bro. Welcome. And meet your partner, Duskla. Okay. Wow. Well. Back on to Esmeralda and Maelstrom to carry the weight. Oh, jeez. And just like that, we're down. We're no longer having a spam of ground types. Okay, so now I have to fight Nessa, which is totally 100% Rosie and Easton's battle. Yes. Okay. Well. This is going to be a short episode. I'm going to save here, and uh, that'll be it for this battle against B. And we'll pick up in the next episode for our next two battles, um, or maybe next three. I don't know. We'll we'll just see how they progress in the next one. But that's it for this episode, episode number 35 of the Pokemon Shield Wedlock. Please leave some respects for Mud. Please leave your respects for Mud. Mud carried us so far through this adventure and the wedding party has prevailed thanks to Mud. Oh, I do need to update. Man, 11 deaths. See, this is this is part of this game is it is so long. And it does get hard and crits, crits and Nuzlocke just kill. But here we are. Well, that's it. 11 deaths, Mud. You will be missed, but you are not forgotten.